And now that we've looked at the basics of HTML, we're going to get a little more advanced here. Uh, not too much. Uh, it's, it's majority of HTML you do for standard web development doesn't really get advanced. So to start this off, let's go ahead and take a look at something we, we saw briefly in the beginning of this series, uh, which was the kind of standard HTML page layout. And to do so, I'm going to go ahead and just create a new document and get in, in Dreamweaver that's control N. And like we discussed before, we're going to do HTML and we want to make sure this is a doc type is HTML5. Go ahead and click create. So here's kind of our standard set of tags. As you noticed in the previous videos, these aren't 100% necessary to make a page show up in a browser, uh, but you do want to use them. Uh, again, what I was doing before was just for example purposes. So let's just really quick run through these. This first tag here, the doc type tag, declares what kind of document this is. And uh, this is an HTML document and it's HTML5. And this is what you want if you want the browser to know that you're gonna wanna render HTML5. The previous doc type tags were, were very lengthy. And so if you create a new page and you see a really lengthy tag up there, chances are you haven't chose the right doc type. So now on line two, we have our HTML tag. And you can see the closing tag down here on line 10. In layman's terms, this basically tells the browser, this is the start of the HTML. The majority of the code we're going to do here in HTML is going to be in either the head and even more so in the body tags. So now on line three we have the head tag and the closing tag on line six. Now you see there's two tags sitting here in the head tag. The most important tag in here at the moment would be the title tag and this is what displays at the top of your browser. Right here there's a URL. Most times if you don't have a title tag you'll see the URL up here in the uh, tab. So if you do have a title tag, the text in between those two opening and closing tags will be what displays up in the tab. So the head of your document is meant for mainly items that you're not going to see rendered on the page. And when I say rendered, if you're not familiar with that term, basically what is displayed when you look at your page in the browser. Items like the title tag, meta tags, which can hold keywords in your, your page description, things like that. Uh, you can put some JavaScript up here, CSS, etc. So after the head and the last of the and the last of these standard tags is the body tag. And the body tag is meant for pretty much anything you want displayed on the page, anything you want rendered out in the browser. Now, that doesn't mean that if you put things up here, if I just put some gibberish text in here, that that should usually show up in the browser. But that's not where it belongs and you shouldn't do that. So just rule of thumb, anything you want to be on the page, displayed on the page in the browser should go in the body. 